All right, so in this section, we're going to talk a little bit about the importance of software updating. And when I say software, I mean pretty much anything, uh, whether it's your operating system, uh, a mobile operating system, or a web platform like WordPress. So one of the biggest problems with software updates is that they are annoying. They can be disruptive. Um, you could some platforms require updates uh, more than others um, but in the long run the little annoyances are definitely worth the damage that can be done to any kind of system that that's out of date uh, hackers will actually study platforms like WordPress and Joomla and, and other popular uh, content management systems or shopping carts and they'll find holes in it to maybe steal information or or um, wreck things or just to mess around so the updates are released so that they can plug up these holes but then hackers will find new holes so it's really an ongoing cycle uh, that's it's just very unfortunate that people there's people out there that want to um, steal and just mess with with people's stuff um, so what kinds of software should be updated? Uh, of course, web content management systems like WordPress and Joomla and Drupal, uh, as well as custom systems, shopping carts and other web software, computer operating systems like Windows, OS X, which is on Macs, uh, Linux distributions, and also mobile operating systems like iOS, Android, Blackberry. Uh, and other customer and product management systems. Why do we need updates? Uh, there's a lot of reasons why we need updates, but these are the probably the most important and the most popular. Um, bug fixes. No programmer is perfect, so all programs need at least a little debugging. Um, you know, you release something that's been tested by maybe one department or two departments and then you release it to the public and you're having thousands or millions of people test the product and they might find bugs that that you missed so uh, that's a, a real popular reason why there's so many updates uh, security updates which are the most important that's the most important reason to keep your system updated uh, like I said hackers can study software and find the little security flaws and they can actually ruin your whole whole system from those flaws uh, improvement systems are always improving technology is always improving uh, the hardware that runs the software is always improving so uh, without updates software would just always be the same and you wouldn't have any better functionality or user interface so that's another important aspect Alright, so when it comes to a WordPress site, what should you update? You should update the core system, uh, which are usually bug fixes, security updates, and major updates. Um, and you would get this from WordPress.org. You can It's very easy to update. We'll actually go over that in a little bit. Uh, you also want to update any WordPress third-party plugins that you have on your site. Uh, and you can usually get the update uh, at the at the developers website and you also want to update your themes if you if you have a, a commercial theme and they release some updates you should definitely look into that as well alright so it's very very crucial that you back up your site before you do any kind of update and it's just I can't stress that enough uh, when you're working with a WordPress site you have two aspects you need to deal with one is the files on the server and then another is your database because if you lose either one of these and you can't get it back then your your site's done with um, and you can do this a few different ways you can do it manually uh, you can get the files through an FTP client like FileZilla uh, and then for your database you can use something like PHP my admin uh, and you can export your database into one file an SQL file and that'll give you all your tables and all your data um, and then you can also use some plugins uh, if you want to do this not manually but through a plugin and here's some links here to some 
backup plugins, backup WordPress, um, back WP up free, uh, and six scan backup. And those are just some that I looked up. Uh, there's other ones you may want to look at as well. So that's it. That's pretty much the gist of why and how you would update your software. Um, next, we'll be getting into safe and secure passwords.